And I like to cook and have leftovers because, to be honest, if the food's not in the fridge ready for me just to at least throw in the microwave or the oven, chances are I'm going to slip. So this is the corn that I have. I simply, on Walmart, I'm going to throw it inside of here with some water to let it boil. And I'll probably just put some sea salt and pepper on it and uh, maybe some paprika once it gets out so a lot of people don't like to eat the corn because they say it's a complex carb but i don't shy away from carbs i just try to be mindful on how much i eat um but anyways this has 19 grams of carbs and that's for one cob and it has one dietary fiber so you can subtract that from the carb count so it's like 18 grams of carbs so if i was doing some type of diet where it's well for example the diet that i used to follow super hard but i'm kind of more lenient now i do uh t between 20 to 50 grams of carbs in a day i definitely had carbs earlier today because i had a sandwich from panera bread um but again i'm not too pressed about that i know my body and with me i can eat a certain amount of carbs burn it off through exercise or just be mindful of what it is that i eat and i'll be good as y'all can see like i am getting so chunky like if you go back a year of my videos i was so focused and i was doing so well but i mean this is a journey you know what i'm saying like you're gonna have your ups you're gonna have your downs and right now i'm in my okay phase but i've recognized i need to get this together so yeah i'm getting back to my shit let that boil and I have the shrimp I'm not sure how I want to cook them I want to sit down <laughs> but I was like I was gonna go to the gym today and since I'm not going to the gym I'm gonna do a workout right here at the house and I'm gonna do T25 if y'all don't know about that it's by Shanti and it will give you a hell of a workout okay so I went ahead and put my shrimp inside of some hot water in a bowl in the sink so that they can thaw I'm gonna go ahead and then prep my corn. Dip with it and get with it because it's like a whole 60 day program where you do the DVD that's on the calendar and that's it, it's only 25 minutes. So I'm gonna do that today. I'm gonna wear my, um, what is this? My polar watch and my heart rate monitor so I can tell how many calories that I burned today. But anyways, with the shrimp, what I was saying is I don't know how I wanna cook it because I wanted it to cook while I'm working out. So by the time I'm done working out, I can eat because I am hungry. All right, y'all. So I told you I really don't feel like doing this, but I didn't meal prep, so I need to do it. And I'm going to cook. Don't be talking mess in my comments about my kitchen either. Cause as you can see, I got dishes in the sink my mom she would flip out if she was in her right mind she'll say something like you know you're supposed to cook in a clean kitchen blah 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 but at this point i'm just trying to get some food that's going to taste good to me and my kid i've been in love with onions lately like grilled onions i'm not going to cut them too small I love grilled onions. I'm loving grilled vegetables, period. So I think I'm gonna experiment some more with that. When y'all cook shrimp, do you take off the tails? Because I'm not with that today. So the shrimp still has the um, tails on it. It kind of looks creepy, man. 
they're like bigger than the normal size I would eat shrimp but I'm sure I'll get over it once I'm done working out and I'll be starving so I'll take my seasonings one by one and put them inside or on top of my shrimp It looks so delicious and it smells even better. I might make some brown rice since I have some of this juice. I think that'd be good. And don't mind my banisher. I'll be doing a video. I will be doing a video on my beauty channel about what that is. Stay tuned. Oops. But I think I'm gonna maybe cook this tonight with this cauliflower rice. Stay tuned. sweaty mess and I'm excited about that because I do not sweat a lot like I just don't sweat so just to see this little glow on my face it makes me excited because typically I only sweat in my chest area my stomach area my back area and my pocketbook area <laughs> I can't be the only one but I finished my workout and now I want to check dinner because I started dinner before I started working out. Dinner is basically done. So I still feel really hot. I'm not even hungry right now. I'm going to probably wait 45 minutes or so to eat dinner. And I decided I'm actually going to cook some cauliflower rice. I think that's going to go really good with the shrimp that I made. I worked out for 29 minutes and I burned 196 calories and my average heart rate was 123 my heart rate peaked to 181 and in my fat burning zone I will put my numbers on the side based off of my height and my weight where I should be in the range to burn fat so hope you guys enjoyed this and I'll be back to show you my dinner Hey. 